Vietnam and the world, but today I'm going to talk about my city, where I live in Vietnam, the capital of uh, Vietnam. So, uh, you know, this, this is not about presentation, it's just like guiding you, if you guys are going to go there some, sometime in the future, so it's going to help you. Hopefully, we will yeah. go there. You know, you guys can, just one month you spend in here, you can live in my home country around more than two weeks. So you can travel a lot, spend money in eating, uh, accommodation, everything. Yeah. It's very cheap. So in the daylight, uh, in the trip, you guys can go some of these places. First of all, this is the Temple of Lisa Nature. It's built around 11, 11th century. It's the place is just, you know, it's just like the university, our university, but in a long time ago, for um, people that, rich people, and uh, some people that, they're gonna work for the, I mean, for the king and uh, for, for the government in that time. So, these are nice places. And uh, <coughs> in here, they, uh, they, did, uh, they dedicated a scholar for people that, that have you know, high marks and uh, forms of The next place is, you can see in here, in the center of Hanoi, is the Grand Opera House. It is built from uh, an architecture from Paris. It's very beautiful in the center of Hanoi. And um, the next one, another place you can go around is Ho Chi Minh Mausoleum, where they put the real, you know, the real body of our Ho Chi Minh leader inside to keep it, how to say, to keep it fresh and just in here. And people come here to pray uh, for him and everything. Another place named One Pillar Power. So uh, this is a very uh, famous place in Hanoi. It's the Hanoi landmark. So it's staying next to the uh, Ho Chi Minh Mausoleum. It's very beautiful. And it's of original power. Another place where you can go that in Hanoi is One Kim Lake. So uh, this is a symbol of Hanoi, where um, Hoang Chien Lek uh, stand in the center of Hanoi, and most it's very popular. Everybody come here when they want to come to Hanoi to see it. And uh, around here, there's a lot of pagoda and temple. You can see over here is a famous bridge, the Red Bridge, in the center of Hanoi. In this lake, it's very big. Yeah. Westlex uh, is another place that you know you have to discover when you're here in Hanoi. It's very large. There's two lakes beside beside Westlex. There's another smaller one, you know, next to it. Next to it. Sorry. It's very very famous. This. Our traditional, you know, just like um, theater. So we play under the water. You know, have you guys seen in the TV around about our traditional play? You know, it's just like a play. So uh, I would say the people that, you know, control these things, they have a long, yeah, some kind of that, and uh, control it under the water. It's very good. It's a traditional play. Oh, beside that, in the nightlife, this uh, nightlife places you can go, it's very interesting. You guys can see this place is near the Hanjim uh, Lake in the center of Hanoi. You will see it in the night. Hanoi looks like, you know, I think it's built. This is a place for people who want to see the rock. And everything, just like a pub for rockers. 
many people, tourists, come here to love They're famous. There's a, just this lap up. We have the, I'll say the address in here, so if you I want, just come here. It's very famous also. Uh, I think just tourists come here. It's not, not the Vietnamese people. Yeah, the locals. It's just like every pub in London. So now I think Midnight Market is very famous. It stand next to Hankin Lake at some places in the night in the midnight. So everybody come here. I mean all the town, I think so. Come here and spend the night, go around, see some product that they want to buy and have fun. That's it. Thank you for watching. Thank you.